Hello everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel and also welcome back to our Animal Crossing Let's Play. Today, I would actually like to do some fish catching with y'all. First of all, I thought it was going to be like an art finding video, I, I, like trying to time travel to find red, to find art pieces that we don't have yet and so on and so forth. But then I did a museum like update recently in the 100th episode and I realized our fish section is actually the saddest looking of them all. So I think we should maybe focus on that one first. We are currently at 25 out of 80 fish. Um, I'm once again using the ACNH guide app. Um, I have all the fish that we already caught it put in. So 25 apparently, which is not that much. Uh, and then I went and checked which month would be best to maybe try and do some fish catching. And it turns out it's September because there's literally 42 fish that we can catch during September, which is like a lot. I think that maybe some of them, like if you don't know, there are catch requirements in Animal Crossing, which means certain fish and insects, I think it works for both of them, only start spawning once you have caught a certain amount of fish or bugs in total. Now, I'm not really sure what those are for, for fish, but to be honest, we have caught 81. Okay, I thought it was actually a little bit less. 81 might be okay. I feel like the catch requirements might be at like 100 max or something. So we'll see, I guess. But so the plan is we're going to time travel to September. I have a bunch of fishing rods. I think I might actually get rid of my net and my customization kits. And I don't think we need the weeds either. And I am going to grab some Nook Mile tickets because I think the best bet is probably just to go to a Nook Mile Island because the spawn rate seems to be higher than on your own island plus i don't think i have all the different um like water features that are needed you know like pond and river cliff top and whatever else there is so we're gonna go to september we're gonna go to a time after 4 p.m um but i think oh I think it probably will probably have to switch in between because they you do catch them at different times So I will meet you again in September after 4 p.m And then we'll see if we can maybe get some stuff for our museum and there we are in September Kellen in September Honestly, not the worst either now I do think the hibiscus look very wrong and then all of the trees are very very dark like I do think that um yeah, cherry blossom season is is way better. Yeah, the trees are so dark. Oh my gosh. Okay, I did also just check. There is actually one bug. It needs to be like before 4 p.m. So we couldn't catch it now. But in case we time travel later, there is one bug that we could actually get at this time. So I am going to take my net after all because in case we find it, we don't want to miss it because we don't have a net with us. So um, yeah, I will say... Uh, let's go on to a Nook Mile Island and let's hope for the best. Also, let's hope that my my fishing skills are up to the task, you know. And our first island seems to be the one with the sister fruit, which is apples for us. And then I think we have a river on this part, right? Yeah, we have a river and basically the cliff top. We have the river mouth. And I'm going to be honest, we're missing so many fish that I think all of them are going to be necessary. Oh my god. Okay, I will say I've been doing a bunch of fishing in um, Fay Farm. Nice! Our first catch. This is a king salmon. I think that's a very good one to start with. Uh, king salmon. There we go. Checkmate. So I think that was a good one. Awesome. All right. Um, I've been doing a bunch of fishing in Fay Farm. And so the... the um, I don't know, the entire mechanic there, in case you haven't seen it, is basically that you have to re- Oh my god, <gasps> the vibrations. This is gonna be a big one. Yay! Okay, that's good. This is an Arapaima, if I'm pronouncing that correctly, which is also in the river. Let me find that. Awesome, cool. Um, but yeah, so in Fay Farm, you basically cast your line, and then in the right moment, you actually have to like reel them in basically and I feel like that is getting to me a little bit because you have to like press you have to press the button to kind of attract the fish um at first and then once you've attracted them you still have to do wait 
Ah, dang it. Okay. Um, you still have to do like a little mini game to even catch them. It's like a little bit complicated to be honest. And so I feel like I'm very much still caught up in that because I believe that for reeling them in or like for even getting them attracted, I need to press the, the button, which is not true. So if I mess up a couple of these, I'm going to blame it on Faith Farm today. <laughs> I'm just gonna go blame it on Faith Farm. Wow, no, we don't, we do have this one multiple times, I think. I don't know at what point I need to maybe focus on the, the shadow size, but I think for now, I will just try and go, sorry. I, I always need to take like a little break and, and just uh, close my eyes for a little bit. But yeah, for now, I will just kind of catch whatever I see. Um... And then we'll kind of go from there. Okay. This one, I think we also already have. Yeah, red snapper. Okay, we definitely need like small, medium, the narrow ones also. And they're all ever, like all day long. And then we need the very large shadows that are basically like the sharks. Like anything with the fin pretty much. Yeah, those should be easy to 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 see, to easy easy to spot at least. Okay, I don't know if this is maybe this might be large, which I don't think we need. <laughs> this might be another red snapper or something like that. Okay, there we go. Oh, it's a tire. <laughs> that did not go quite like I expected it to, but uh, sure, why why not? You know. Okay, I'm also going to go and catch the small one if I can. That's a little far away, maybe. There we go. Is that better, maybe? Come on, fishy. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Oh, and it bit right away, too. This is a Crucian Carp, which I already have. Okay. Oh, it was going very well at first, and now we've run into a bit of a rep repetitive uh, motion. Or not motion, but like, yeah, repetitive fish, I guess. Okay, there's some here that are all relatively the same size, but, you know. Oh, it's swimming. Yeah. Ah, dang it. I messed that up. I didn't see anything, and then I, I got nervous. Yeah, I really have to learn. I have to relearn the fish catching. I am so sorry. This was already a pain last time that we did this, uh, and now having, like, taken such a long break from... From, from fish catching. Oh, did I didn't notice. I didn't realize that that had started being attracted. Okay. All right. Next one caught at least. Definitely have this one. Definitely have this one. Not a bad, not as bad as the sea bass, but the 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 bass we we have. Yes. Okay, this might be like a medium-sized shadow. Let's see this. All right, got it. <sighs> Is this gonna be the new sea bass? The zebra turkey fish? Is that gonna be it? Oh, there's a big one here. I think I already have like the biggest one that I need though, which was the Arapaima. There is a river cliff top fish, which I should try and get probably. Okay. <gasps> Yay! Oh, we have the soft chair turtle. I should take a shelfie. Aww. Okay, and I did bring some vines so I can just climb up here and then try and catch the fish like this. That should hopefully work. I have no idea if these also have catch requirements. And if so, I don't know if we have them. Oh my god. There's no reason for me to be so nervous with these, but like I really am. Okay, I already have a sweet fish, it seems. Right. Okay, let's check the sea again. Let's go here. Oh, there's something large right there. I feel like once again, I don't know if I need large fish. Okay. Oh, that might be a sea bass. Yeah. Yeah. I can tell from the controller vibrations, I feel like. <laughs> okay, there is something big or, or, yeah, probably large right here also. Oh, there we go.
Might be another one. Oh, flounder. Or olive flounder, yep. Okay, so there's something here, and then there's a smaller one on the right-hand side. Oh, that one bit right away. I'm not prepared for that. You can't do that to me. <sighs> okay, we have a salmon this time, though. That's really good. Oh, I could cook something with this fish. Yay! Oh, yeah, this was also a river mouth fish, actually. There's a couple more here. There's the sturgeon, which is river mouth. Oh, and apparently the sturgeon is also river mouth, but that is, like, the largest shadow. I don't know if this also just counts as like river because if it counts as river we can catch some more stuff if it only counts as river mouth then i think we've caught everything except for like the largest shadow which i don't know what the largest shadow is i i get confused by these sizes not gonna lie okay all right i don't think that is the largest one though oh yeah that's another another salmon okay Okay, I kind of want to get this like smaller kind of thing, but I can't. Oh, okay, that's not it. Yeah, I kind of want to get that one. Okay, there we go. All right, I got it at least. Oh, yay! It is the mitten crab. All right. There's also definitely a couple of pond fish. And then also there's the pier fish. I think the pier fish we might have to approach with some... Uh, with some bait. I don't think there's really any way around that. There's definitely still like a very large shadow in the river, a small shadow, smallest, small. Okay, then there's some I can't get at this time right now, and large, large and very large. Okay, so I'm looking for like very small shadows and very large ones. Cool, <laughs> perfect, not confused at all. <laughs> all right, let's go with this one. That was way too fast. I was not prepared. And then I think that probably would have been like a good one because it actually also left right away. Some of them have like a couple of seconds. Where you can like hesitate and you still catch them, but not this one. All right, another sweet fish. Great. Just great. Just what I need. Oh, there's a small one. Okay. I need the small one. That's good. I think. Yep. Okay, I, I caught it. It is. Oh, 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 it's a freshwater goby. Wow, this one looks so cool. What the heck? Okay, freshwater goby caught. All right. And we'll continue. I'm pretty sure that is a medium size. We do not need that one. I do want to maybe try and get this one here. Yes. Okay, we caught it. It is a black bass. Awesome. I think I said this last time, this seems to be a very large shadow. All right, oh my God, the vibration. This might be another, <gasps> yes! I was gonna say this might be another one of like the first one. Oh no, wait, the Arapaima I think is river. Nice, we got the sturgeon. Okay, that also means we have caught all the river mouth fish during this time at least. So whenever something spawns here, I guess we're just gonna ignore it or even get it to like leave us alone, I guess. And we've also caught a hundred fish. So maybe this is gonna be another, um, another catch requirement thing or or something i should maybe look that up so i can give you better information <gasps> oh my god look how tiny oh is it like a sea butterfly or like a seahorse wait no the butterfly hold on the butterfly i think is <gasps> it's a seahorse oh that's so cute <laughs> I think the butterfly actually is a critter, so you dive for that one. Oh, there's something small over here. I want to see if we can catch this one, because I think that might be something new still. Okay, there we go. All right, there we go. Gosh, sometimes when they take too long, I also get very impatient. Oh, yeah. Okay, this is the, uh, is it like an angelfish? That other fish told me to do it. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, so for the river right now, I still need the very large shadow and a large and another very large. I think all the others I can catch at this time right now. So I guess all of these are probably too small, right? 
Yeah, all of you be gone. I need like large, large fish. Is that a large maybe? Oh, there's one um there's one up on the cliff too that might be considered large. I definitely want to try and get that one too. All right. Okay, well I got I got this one, which is Oh, nether turtle. I do think they're maybe considered large though. I'm not sure. Um Okay, so you Yes. Oh, and it also bit right away. Oh my god. It's a tire! Yay! Oh! Wait, I found one before, and that one I couldn't uh, use, or like I didn't get an idea for a DIY. This one I now did. I wonder because if it's because it's like one where you need multiple tires for it or something. Okay, all of you I don't need, I think. You are way too small now. I, I'm gonna need like your your big brothers or sisters. I do think I need small one in the sea, right? Okay. All right, caught it. What is it? Trash, it's trash. I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm so happy, fishing is so much fun. I don't think I need you. <laughs> I'm being so rude now. I don't know if any of these are actually large. Most of these I feel like are just medium sized. Like you right here, I don't trust you at all. There's also like barely any fish in the sea here, which isn't great. I don't know if I maybe should have brought my own like bait over to the beach, uh, to the Nookmile Island, sorry. <laughs> like maybe I should have done that. Is that a thing that you need to do because sea fish, sea stuff just doesn't really show up? I'm not sure. Okay, well, I caught this one. It doesn't look good, though. Yeah. Okay, new bugs and fish will apparently spawn after 20, 50, and 100 catches. I feel like I did actually see this list before that showed me, that basically showed me all of the different uh, catch requirement things. But I don't know where I found that. And if I, I feel like if I Google, I can't find anything. Okay, so it seems the ones that start spawning after you've had uh, or caught like 100 fish are mostly the ones on like the cliff top, honestly. Um, the thing I'm unsure about now is do they already spawn? Because I've like, I'm, now I've reached it, but I did travel onto this island before I had reached that. I didn't want to catch you actually. I want to, I wanted to catch the other one anyway. Um, or do I need to like leave and, t and come to like a new island, you know? I don't know. And I'm also like curious because no, no, um, I've seen no shark just yet. Like I've seen absolutely zero like fins in the sea. And I feel like on a Nook Mile Island, that's actually a little un uncommon. They do appear until September though. Like they really do. Okay, here's a small one. Let's try and get this one. I don't know. Oh yeah, there we go. All right. Yeah, no, <laughs> absolutely not. <laughs> absolutely not on this one here. <gasps> My God, why are there so many big fish here? I feel like I want to maybe get this one. There do not need to be three river mouth fish, to be honest. Yay, okay. I just hate it. I just don't like it. Okay, I like this turtle, but it's also, this is enough now. And that's my first fishing rod, okay. I like that one, but I have caught enough of it now. So why don't we just move on? Okay, but we have caught one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight new ones. Eight new ones, you know, not too shabby. Um, I would say that I feel like some of the, some of the sea, like, fish should be much, e like, should be easy to get. I'm namely thinking about, like, the, the sharks. I started playing in July, and I remember they were, like, not an issue to spawn, at least, you know? All right, next one. All 
All right, okay. Nope. Hey, the bared knife jaw and the surgeon fish, I won't lie to you, they should not be this hard to get. <laughs> they should not be this hard to get. Okay, next one. Oh, bit right away. Nope. It's another freaking zebra turkey fish. Okay, there's some small ones here. Not what I'm looking for, like at all. There's nothing on top of the cliff either. <gasps> there's something with a fin. Okay, let's see. Oh my god, yes, I got it. Okay. And it's the whale shark. There she blows. I caught a whale shark. I'm telling you, it was this big. They are a giant in real life. Oh, oh my god, yes, swap it. Do not let it go, girl. <laughs> Do not let it go. You know what? Zebra turkey fish, I don't have time for you. You go and leave me alone. All right, I am gonna go and maybe catch this one. I think this is a medium, so this might be something good. I caught it. And it's... Please let it go. Let it, just let it go. Okay. And you know what? Um, there is something small up here, but I don't think we need anything this small from the river cliff top. Uh, shoot that one away. Good, good job. There's something with the fin. See, that's what I said. Okay. And I got it. Nice. And it is. Nice, it's something new. I was like, please don't let it be another whale shark. I caught an ocean sunfish. Good thing I'm wearing ocean sunscreen. Okay, swap this one. And you know what? We're just gonna get rid of another zebra turkey fish. There we go. Okay, and I think now I will go back to um, my own island for a quick second. We will donate what we have and um, then maybe go to like another island. Maybe we can try and get one with a pond. Uh, or we can check if any of the ponds uh, on our island have fish in it. So yeah, let's go do that. All right, I would like to make a donation. I have a couple of fish, let's go. So we have the king salmon, the arapaima, ocean sunfish, the soft shell turtle, as well as salmon, the mitten crab and freshwater goby, the sturgeon and angelfish, and the whale shark. Right, let's go donate. All right, quick checkup. Okay, everything is donated. Awesome. So I think the rest I will just go ahead and sell. Uh, and then let's check our ponds. Okay, nothing in this pond. I'm honestly not sure we have another that qualifies. Oh, we have the one by the resin services because I'm not sure the entire like the big lake in the back actually does qualify as a as a pond or if that already counts as like a river or something. I have absolutely no idea what the requirement there is. Um, and I will also just briefly check my oceans no no just the ones that i see i think it is probably much better to just go and uh fly to nook mile island but just the ones i see i might briefly check just because it's a little bit quicker i'm just going to use the drop off box uh usually i wouldn't recommend this because you do lose like a little bit of money but i just don't i don't want to go inside you know so i'm just going to drop it off there apparently earn some money got some miles yeah, there we go. And then time for another Nook Mile Island. Okay, here we are. And it does seem as though we do have like a pond, but we also have, actually, I actually don't know. Does this count as a pond? I think so, right? And then we do have another river, which we don't really need, but that's okay, I guess. Let's check the sea first. I still need something small, I think. So we're gonna get this one here. There we go, okay. And it's the horse mackerel. Great, great times. Good, good one, good one. Okay, nothing in the pond, but tons of stuff in the river. Oh, we have two big things next to each other, but none of them have a fin, which makes me very suspicious because I don't think there is anything without a fin that we can catch, you know? And I also messed it up, so, you know. There we go. There we go. Okay, next chance. 
I swear, the one time I did have my eyes open, I messed it up. Oh, another tire. Great. Well, at least we're cleaning the ocean. You know, that's at least that. I think this is the small list, right? I don't think we need this one. This might be medium. I think we need this one for sure. Oh, there's another very small one. All right, there we go. Gosh, so nerve wracking. Yay! Oh my god, finally, the Baird Knife Jaw. Let's go. They must have a hard time eating. Mm -hmm. I could cook something with this fish. So creepy. <laughs> I don't like that she does that. <laughs> okay, um, let's try and find some more stuff with a fin. I think there's quite a few things there that we're still missing. I don't know what the eel... Because the ribbon eel shows as a narrow shadow, and then for the moray eel, it shows as like an undefined shadow. I'm pretty sure it's also the narrow one, though. So we need narrow shadows or a small. There's still nothing in the pond. We need narrow shadow or something small or something very large. The ray doesn't have a fin, does it? Yeah, so I guess... We also tr still try and catch this one. Okay, sea bass, great. Um, but yeah, so the saw shark, the hammerhead shark, the great white shark, the sucker fish also has a fin, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, and then the others are like rainy or like later on in the day. Okay, I don't need you then. I definitely don't need you. Oh, I don't need, I don't know if I can even get over to the other side, but there's also some stuff here that might be interesting, especially like the large one. Let's try and get that one. Come on, fishy, fishy, turn around. Okay, maybe not. Oh my God, it's like right in front of you. That was like literally right in front of you. I, there we go. That, I'm pretty sure that was a river cliff top fish because it was so hard to get okay how do i get down here can i get down here yes um because like a lot of the fish they will really just they will give you a second to kind of calm down but that one didn't and so it makes me think it was a hard to catch fish which kind of sucks because you know i need those Yay! Oh, see, this one is much more cooperative. We love to see that. So here we have the ray, which also means I think we can stop catching like large shadows. Um, just the ones with a fin or the narrow ones, I think. And still the small one. We still need the surgeon fish. Okay, not you. Is this small? I guess this is probably small, huh? That could be another... Where's mackerel though? Let's see, let's find out. It is an anchovy. Oh, are anchovies like, oh my God, already? Are anchovies like very small or are they small? Hmm, okay, there's something here, which is good because now we can figure out if this is considered a pond or not. Well, not if the fish doesn't even like bite though. <laughs> Oh, okay, we definitely have to wait for it to turn, and now I'm gonna be too late again, huh? And too far away. Oh my gosh, okay. I'm too far away. Come on, fishy. Oh, that might be it. Come closer. A little closer. Come on, you got this. Or not. How about this one, then? Come on. Yeah. Okay, let's see. It is actually a pond fish, I'm pretty sure, because kois are pond. They are. Okay, perfect. Perfect, perfect. So we can definitely try and keep an eye out on that one. Um, I think like most of the time it's not going to be too fruitful, though. There was something pretty large here. Oh, it did just, uh, it did just swim away, though. I don't want the small fish. Okay. 
I don't want the small fish. I want the large one. All right. Okay, I got it. Let's see what it is. Oh, this might be new. <gasps> yes, a pike. Okay. The pike was the very large shadow. Okay, so what else can I find at this time in the river? I can still find the arowana and the dorado, which are large and very large still. But I think these are all, I don't know if all three of these are considered mouth, river mouth, right? Maybe you can try to find or catch this one right here. This first one. Yeah, that one. Okay, let's see what this is. Oh yeah, it is It is definitely still river mouth. Okay. Hmm. Right, so I don't need you. Let's check out if I can find... Oh, this is too small again, right? I don't know why I'm having such a hard time deciding between the shadow sizes. Or like most of the time, honestly, I think I can decide. It's just hard for me to make the decision. Like I can tell the difference... Okay, I can tell the difference, but I don't want to make the decision and be like, okay, no, I don't want to catch this. Let's just chew it away. Because then I keep thinking like, what if it was the one I needed? Like, what if that was legit the one I needed? Okay, we have some pond party going on over here. This kind of looks specifically, or this kind of looks um, suspiciously like the koi again. And I think that we need more of a small shadow size for the pond. I like how my bobber thingy just stays where it is, though. Oh my god. And then the fish turns in exactly, like, a complete different location. <sighs> Alright, let's find out if this is a koi. It is not! Oh! It is a catfish. Yeah, that was the large shadow. Okay. Okay, let's see for the pond. So we need a small, the smallest shadow. At this time right now, we need the smallest shadow and the largest shadow. Those are the only ones. The smallest and the largest. Now, is that the largest shadow? I don't know. Oh, I have now caught 40 different fish in total, though. That's amazing. Now, this might be large. God, that took long. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's another catfish. Okay, so this was probably like a large shadow. So we need a size small, uh, li size larger, sorry, a size larger or very, very, very small. Okay, I want this big one here. Maybe if I can get that, that might have been, oh, there we go. All right, I got it. It's not correct though. We already have this. Okay. Nothing going on up there. Let's check the ocean. There's something like medium size here. Oh, this one might be small. Okay, let's try and get this. All right. Surgeon fish, please. Crying out loud. The horse mackerel and the sea bass are just too annoying. They're just too annoying. They need to leave this game. All right, there really isn't a ton of pond action going on. I think I maybe should really try and find that one island that has um, this like giant, giant pond, you know? Or tell you what, you know what? We're gonna go to 10 a.m. or something and try and go to another Nook Mile Island and catch a few of like the earlier fish and see if that's also gonna be successful. Let's hope. Oh, and we found the one with a pond. Let's go. Okay, let me check briefly. Okay, so we need two of the smallest and one of the small shadows from the pond. And I think the others are probably like river. I don't know if there was anything in the sea that I can still get at this time. Oh yeah, we still can find the surgeon fish. And we can still find the eels also. And the sucker fish. Okay, so yeah, let's keep an eye out for those. I definitely want to try and get these small shadows here, which is going to be a little task, but let's try and... Let's try and... Uh, single these out here. Yeah, there we go. All 
All right, first one we got, which is, is the goldfish, I think, right? Yeah, okay, good, first one. And then this one could be also one of the, one of the ones that we need, maybe. Once again, we just have to try and get it and not run, because I will, of course. Come on, turn around, fishy. All right, there we go. All right, we got it. And it is an empty can, which now I have an idea for. Okay, what are these trash ideas that I'm having? Oh, recycled can thumb piano. I had a carpaccio as an, as an idea and then probably like this stack of tires or something. Oh my God, great. Well, I'm glad I'm at least creative, you know? Okay, here, oh, there is a lot of small shadows here. Let's go. God, this pond is almost like a little bit too big. It's like really hard to catch anything here. Oh. All right. Oh my God, everything else disappeared. Oh, oh, Popeye goldfish, let's go. Okay, so we just need another small shadow, which is the ranchu goldfish, which I'm not sure if that over there is it, or if these are too small. See, that's where it starts again. This is where I overthink. There's one like, I'm not sure. I don't know if I should get this or whatever. Okay, let's go. Let's see and find out. Oh, that was a stone. All right, cool item, <laughs> yeah, it's fine. Gosh, is this normal? Is it normal to catch this much trash or do I just attract it or something? I don't know. Listen, I would not be surprised, but still a little hurt. Still a little hurt. All right. Oh my God, I almost messed it up twice. Is that what I need? That is what I need. Okay. All right. So that means I think I have all the pond fish I needed this time, which is really good. It's really, really good. Okay, there's something very large here. I don't think we need anything large from the sea. I think we still need the very small one. Not smallest, but it's like small. And then anything with the fin or narrow. Also, since we're here, you know what? I'm gonna grab this fossil because we do need fossils still. Are any of you also working on your Critterpedia today? Can be pretty much anything. Doesn't have to be fish, can be bugs, can be uh, sea critters or, or whatever else. That is a small one, right? And I also found a message in a bottle. So, um, cardboard chair, I already have. Cool. All right. Let's, let's see about this fish, shall we? Okay. Caught it and... Okay, this is smallest. I don't need that. I do maybe need this. It is small. So let's hope. Surgeon fish. The surgeon fish is not rare, right? It's not rare. It's just a it's just not it's just refusing to show up for me. That's what it is. That's a medium shadow, I think. Oh, small shadow, let's go. Okay. I'm so tired, you know. <laughs> I'm so tired. Next one. Wait, I almost messed that up. Okay, I think this one is too small. I can't believe that was just so many horse mackerels in a row. Not you. Okay, there is a small one too. There we go. Almost, almost. Butterfly fish is better than horse mackerel, but I need the surgeon fish. 
Okay, there's something small or extra small. I'm not sure. Oh, ain't it bit right away. Okay, don't let this turn into the new horse mackerel, though, please. <laughs> I can't. I can't deal with that, please. Okay, there's a lot of small fish, though. Not really many large ones, to be honest. Okay. Oh. I want to cry a little bit. I feel like the pond fish was such a, like, that was so good. It was going so well for a little bit, you know? And then... And then the horse mackerel and butterfly fish of this world teamed up against me and just are watching me suffer now. Okay, there's something small here. All right, let's go. Let's not go. Let's not go. I don't want to end with like no success though. Uh, those are both too small, right? Uh, that one's too big for sure. I think both of those are too small. I'm gonna try and catch one. And I'm pretty sure... I'm gonna be disappointed. Yep. Actually, we need, we need, we need his friend. We need, uh, Dory. We don't need Nemo, we need Dory right now. So... Yeah. Oh, small one. There we go. Okay. Caught it. And... I don't want to comment on it. <laughs> I don't want to comment on it. I just want to be sad about this and just, you know. Okay. Okay, there's like nothing spawning now. Also fun. I kind of want to get this fish crossed off the list though before I end because like I know we struggled with this one last time and I already was saying kind of like this is not that can't be real okay there is another small one here I think okay and a bit right away too I was just running around for like five minutes and nothing like even remotely small spawned and so this was like i don't know that was a moment of hope for me and nothing oh there's something with a fin okay let's try this oh wow it's so strong wait I thought I could only maybe get the sucker fish at this time. Ah, oh, dang it. I got so excited because I thought like... <gasps> Yay! I thought I was like... I got so excited because I thought we could end with something new at least. And then it was the ocean sunfish or whatever it's called. Okay, but the ribbon heel is 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 new and we can't carry anything. That's okay. We will just swap it. I have many horse mackerels to choose from. Do not worry. Do not worry at all. It's always really hard for me to really guess how long these fish catching episodes are because I always like... There's, there's a bunch of silence just in between. But um, I think that was probably long enough. And we will end with, how fitting, a horse mackerel. Um, I'm so glad I dumped the recipe before so I could carry that. <laughs> so glad I can take the horse mackerel with me, you know? It's just very important that I take it home and uh, treasure it because it's very rare. You, bar you barely ever catch a horse mackerel. I don't know if, if, if you've ever caught a sea bass because they're also... They're really hard to come by. Not gonna lie, they are really, really, really hard to find. Like, if you find, like, big fish in the sea, they're basically never a sea bass. Okay, cool. So, <laughs> with this kind of successful, um, I mean, we have one more spot. Like, let's get one more fish 
and then donate what we have and then, you know, celebrate, celebrate what we have achieved today, I guess. Oh, there's something small. Let's just catch this and then be on our way. Let's just catch this, she said, and then mess it up. Okay, I gotta I I gotta find something else. That was not the surgeon fish though. I could feel it. I I know that was also that was definitely a horse mackerel. And if anybody says anything else in the comments, you know? Okay, here's something small. Let's go. Let's see if I can get this. Fit right away, and I got it. And it's an anchovy. Okay. <laughs> well, let's go back home and donate what we got to Blathers, okay? So so we see the fruits of our labor, I guess. Oh, I'm just running past this, and there's actually some river fish that during this time that we can also catch. I'm gonna just try and get this. Maybe it'll be something new. Maybe not. It is? Nothing new. Okay, well in that case, just let it go. Let it go back into its natural habitat, and that also breaks your fishing rod. You know what? I think that's a good end. I think that's a, it's a good way to tell me to stop it. Let's make a donation. All right, so we have caught the koi and the bear knife shaw, the ray, the pike, and the catfish, the goldfish, Popeye goldfish, and ranchu goldfish, awesome, and the ribbon eel. Okay, let's confirm that. There we go. And then just a quick checkup donation. Nothing else can be donated. All right. So that, I think, concludes our little fishing trip from today. Let me just check real quick. So now we are at 44 out of 80 fish. So we have we have made some progress. I guess I probably would have loved for that to be like a little bit more. But, you know, uh, that's fine. And then um, the overall list for September has gone down to 23. So I think we started with 42, so we've almost caught 20 new fish. Um, and I think, I think that's probably good. That's probably good. Um, I hope you enjoyed the episode today. Thank you all so much for watching and hanging out. Make sure you give it a thumbs up. Uh, leave a comment if you want to. Tell me how your fish collection is doing. And then make sure that you subscribe so you don't miss any of the future episodes. And then I hope that you have an awesome time until I see you in my next video. Bye, everyone.